In this podcast episode, featuring Scott Galloway, a professor of marketing at NYU Stern School of Business, the discussion revolves around the challenges faced by young men in today's society. Galloway highlights the alarming statistics that show young men are three times more likely to be addicted, four times more likely to commit suicide, and 12 times more likely to be incarcerated compared to women. He emphasizes the need for empathy and support for young men as they are struggling with issues such as lack of economic prospects, maturity, and mentorship. Galloway paints a grim picture of the current state of young men, pointing out the lack of empathy and support they receive in society. He discusses how societal constructs have led to a conflation of toxicity with masculinity, leaving many young men feeling isolated and vulnerable. Factors such as the education system, lack of vocational programs, and a skewed dating market contribute to the challenges faced by young men today. Galloway stresses the importance of mentors and male role models in the lives of young men. He highlights the impact of having a strong male figure in a boy's life, citing data that shows a significant difference in outcomes for boys who lack male role models. He calls for more men to get involved in primary and secondary education to provide guidance and support to young men. The conversation delves into the economic challenges faced by young people. Galloway discusses the transfer of wealth from young people to older generations, citing examples such as the mortgage tax deduction and capital gains tax benefits that disproportionately benefit older individuals. He criticizes the lack of opportunities for young people and the widening wealth gap between generations. Galloway questions whether America can survive the current challenges and calls for a reevaluation of economic policies that prioritize older generations over young people. He emphasizes the need for a social contract that provides equal opportunities for all individuals, regardless of age or background. Galloway reflects on the importance of finding purpose and contributing to something greater than oneself. He discusses the impact of his mother's death and the birth of his children on his outlook on life. He acknowledges the transformative power of these experiences in shifting his focus from personal success to serving others. He emphasizes the value of being present in the moment, expressing emotions authentically, and building meaningful connections with loved ones. Galloway reflects on his struggles with addiction and how hitting rock bottom was a turning point for him. He acknowledges the role of suffering in pushing him towards change and emphasizes the need to be ready for transformation. He also discusses the role of faith in his life, mentioning how it has provided him with strength and a sense of awe and wonder. He talks about the importance of surrendering control and being open to guidance from others, highlighting the value of humility in personal growth. Galloway shares valuable advice for young people starting their careers, focusing on the importance of finding one's talent and committing to becoming the best in a field with high employment rates. He emphasizes the need for diversification in investments and the benefits of long-term thinking when it comes to building wealth. He also stresses the significance of developing a savings muscle and being disciplined in financial decisions, pointing out that economic security requires hard work and dedication. For individuals in midlife who are feeling unfulfilled in their careers, Galloway suggests having open and honest conversations with partners about potential lifestyle changes. He highlights the importance of partnership and mutual support in navigating career transitions and financial challenges. He shares his own experience of making difficult decisions to improve his financial situation and emphasizes the value of pushing oneself to test limits and build confidence. Drawing parallels between athletics and personal growth, Galloway discusses the benefits of pushing oneself to physical and emotional limits. He emphasizes the resilience and endurance that come from facing challenges head-on and highlights the confidence that can be gained from testing one's limits. He encourages young people to engage in activities that push them out of their comfort zones and help them discover their true potential. The conversation shifts towards masculinity and the need to redefine traditional gender roles. Galloway challenges the notion that masculinity is synonymous with toxicity advocating for a celebration of masculine attributes like strength, protection, and service. 
He encourages men to lean into their emotions, embrace vulnerability, and prioritize relationships over individual achievements. Galloway stresses the importance of leaning on friends and mentors for support, especially when navigating career changes or personal struggles. He acknowledges the societal pressure men feel to appear successful and put together, which can hinder their ability to ask for help. Galloway raises concerns about the increasing rates of loneliness among men, citing alarming statistics on male suicide rates. He discusses the potential threat of AI algorithms targeting lonely individuals and radicalizing them. He emphasizes the need for men to engage in real-world interactions, build friendships, and seek support to combat feelings of isolation and vulnerability. When it comes to instigating positive change in individuals, Galloway emphasizes the importance of willingness and receptivity. He shares his approach to coaching young men, focusing on fitness, financial independence, and social engagement. He highlights the role of friends and mentors in influencing behavior and guiding individuals towards personal growth. Galloway provides insights into the current state and future trajectory of podcasting as a medium. He notes the income inequality within the podcasting industry, with a few top podcasts dominating the revenue and profits. Despite the challenges, he acknowledges the intimacy and trust that podcast hosts build with their listeners, making it a unique form of media. He also highlights the underpriced advertising opportunities in podcasting and its potential for targeted marketing.